A governor and first lady have just lit Idaho's Capitol Christmas tree on the steps of the state capitol. It's an annual tradition. Our Gretchen Parsons gives us a live look at that magnificent 30 foot blue spruce. What a scene out there, Gretchen. Mark. Mark, certainly magnificent, as you said. There are hundreds of people here to take part in this annual tradition. And like you said, just moments ago, the governor lit this beautiful tree, a 30-foot blue spruce tree. And I'm told this was donated from a local family here in Garden City, the Skinner family. They actually planted this tree back in 1977. And it was quite the process to get the tree here because as you can see, it's huge. The Idaho Department of Lands, they chopped the tree down and they hauled it here and it had to be escorted by the Boise Police Department. And fun fact, something I just learned, to ensure that the tree doesn't tip over or anything like that, it's actually anchored 20 feet in the ground. There's a permanent tree stand at the Capitol and even though it's anchored 20 feet down, it's still 30 feet tall. So that really gives you a sense just how massive this tree is. There's a lot going on here. The children's choir, they just wrapped up singing a bunch of Christmas songs to a wide-eyed crowd. But you can still come down here because there's still things to do. A lot of people, they're moving inside the Capitol. It's much warmer there. In the Capitol, it's actually beautifully decorated inside for the holidays. There's ornaments, garland. It's truly quite a sight to see. And there's free sugar cookies as well, so you've got to love that. And new this year, there's eight food trucks that are lined up just across from the Capitol. So if you haven't eaten anything tonight, there's certainly a variety of food here. And like I said, Mark, it's really the holiday atmosphere down here. And it's really nice. And you got to see this tree in person because it is magnificent. Back to you. Well, we can tell from your live shot, we can hear the sounds of children reveling in this night. So it looks like a great event for everyone. Gretchen, thank you.